The offseason is over and baseball is back in the desert. ASU baseball played host on Friday night to the Santa Clara Broncos on a beautiful night at Phoenix Muni. The highly productive offense from a year ago got right back to work as ASU took an early lead and never looked back. In the 11-6 win, the Sun Devils had a lot go right, but the most impressive performance came on the mound. ASU sent out one of their new young arms to set the tone for 2024. In a season with such lofty expectations where the only questions seemed to be surrounding the pitching staff, freshman righty Thomas Burns came in and delivered from the start. He went five innings, he had seven strikeouts, only allowed one run, and from the moment he stepped on the mound, he looked like he belonged. Even with how impressive Burns' performance was, how he was able to handle himself under pressure was no surprise to Bloomquist. He just does an outstanding job of controlling the things he can control and, and um, you know, even with the longer innings, he was down there moving around and, and staying loose. So I, he's he's bred to be a starter. That's he's done that his whole life, and and um, so I, I I expected him to you know, do what he did. Along with his young righty, Bloomquist was happy with how the rest of the team was able to approach the game on offense. That approach turned into an output that is every pitcher's best friend. I mean, for me, that's huge. Like. Pitching when it's even is definitely a lot harder than pitching when you're up a ton. But you can you can pitch a little more relaxed and like just pound the zone and trust that the defense will make plays. Bloomquist said he wanted the team to control the accounts and stay aggressive, and it worked. In the second inning, the Sun Devils attacked Santa Clara senior Cade Pilkert, putting up five runs. Adding three more in the third, ASU put on cruise control and never looked back. The team is back at it for two more games against Santa Clara on Saturday and Sunday before hosting Kansas State in a midweek matchup on Tuesday. From Tempe for Inferno Intel, I'm Stephen Buxton.